Hello everyone, I'm Brian. Today I'm doing a trailer reaction to Malignant, trailer number one, 2021. So, this looks like a horror movie. Uh, there... I don't know if there's been much horror movies that have come out lately. I haven't watched a horror movie in a while. I'm hoping this is a good one though, so let's go ahead and give this trailer a shot. I'm having visions. Oh, that's, it was transformed into someone else's house. The body house. of Dr. Florence Weaver was found brutally murdered in her home this morning. Did you know her? No, but I saw her die. I'm seeing things. I'm seeing murders. As they're happening. Oh, okay, that's not Hello? good. He says his name is Gabriel. Someone from my past. Happy birthday. Whatever happened to you before you joined our family hurt you in a way that I can't even imagine. Oh, she's adopted. Stop saying that. Maddie, who are you talking to? Gabriel. Is he your imaginary friend? Imaginary friend? Imaginary friend? He's the devil. Huh. Oh, I missed that. <laughs> I was looking at his the light switch. Whatever it was, it's back. Uh, uh. That was really cool. He killed just... again. He's getting closer. He wants to talk to you. Well, at least he knows how to pick up a cell phone. My new iPhones for the devil. Well, what do you know? <laughs> Coming for me. Who are you, Gabriel? <laughs> I've been painted so much. I watched too many horror movies when I was young. <laughs> So I, I will say though, it, it's pretty cool. It's pretty interesting. I'm curious. So let's go over the trailer here. So we see she's sleeping. And I was wondering what was going on. It's like, oh, that's a really cool effect. It's going to go like a horror movie style, but it actually transform into the person that's getting murdered's house or room. And I'm wondering if the people that Gabriel's killing is re somehow connected to her. I have a feeling it is. It has to. I mean, it's basically Gabriel's going to kill everyone that has been is related to her in some way, and then her as the final victim. And I said, you know, you have a cool ability that you could use to the greater good to help out people, but you can only do it as it is happening, like she says right here. Hello. Or maybe a little bit before. He says his name is seeing murders as they're happening. There you go, as they're happening. So yeah, not not well better than nothing, I suppose. But things says that Madison's ninth birthday, Christmas. You joined our family, hurt you in a way that I can't even imagine. She was adopted. Stop saying that, Maddie. Who are you talking to? Gabriel. Kids are the devil too because they have imaginary murderous friends for some odd reason. Kids make friends with murderous people or entities. <laughs> that was super cool, I'll say. This scene was that was really good. That was really good. Wow, I need to watch it again. Did she? That was that was good. Did she like float into this? This was kind of scary, but after watching it crawl, it, it didn't look right, so it just looked odd to me. Like, it clearly there's a wire. It's back. Yeah. Uh, 
whenever they do it right, it does look creepy, but whenever you see kind of, it looks a little janky, it kind of removes, that looks like a face, that's an eye, that's a mouth there, that's another eye maybe over there, nose right there, man, yeah, that's, that's an odd placement of the face. Kill every, every kill, every moment, brings them closer to you. I'm glad he knows how to use an iPhone though. I wonder if face recognition works. <laughs> Making jokes. That is super cool. I, you know, it looks, honestly, looks really good. I'm curious now. I uh, certainly hope it comes on Amazon Prime for sure. So it's an imaginary friend screaming at her in the bed. Can we see her face? It looks white, like pestilence, bubbles and stuff, and almost like uh, the ring character. I forgot what her name was. So it does look pretty good, actually. Um, let me see you know when it's come out in theaters. Nine, ten, twenty-one. Well, with still the things that's going around, I don't know if I'm gonna be going to the theater to watch it, but definitely, if I get a chance to watch it, I definitely will check it out. I've not watched a horror movie in a little bit. And I'm kind of itching for one. Maybe that's the reason I watch horror games is because uh, I can't play them, but I'll certainly watch people play them. <laughs> I get scared the same way either way. So anyways, this trailer actually looks pretty good. It makes me curious about why children are the devil. Nah, <laughs> what? Why is Gabriel, who is Gabriel? They said it's Satan. And why is Gabriel doing this? Not too many questions. Again, horror movies are pretty straightforward. They're not necessarily so deep. So it's something you can sit back and enjoy and scare you crapless. Anyways, what do you guys think about the trailer? Did it make you want to watch it? Did the trailer do a good job in trying to get you to wonder and want to go watch it? Let me know in the comments below. If you like my content, please consider subscribing. Thumbs up, thumbs down, down below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next vid.